Hey, what is up guys, this is iReviews, in this video I will show you the best lock screen tweaks for your iOS 8.4 device. The first tweak for this video is called App Box. This tweak allows you to quickly launch apps from the lock screen. You can see right here, if I go to the lock screen of my device, I can slide here from the right side and I have all these icons, I can go ahead and launch any of these apps directly from here. Now let's go to the settings of this tweak, as you can see, right here we have an enable button to enable app box, then you have apps, if you go here, you have all the apps that you add on app box, you can add them simply by dragging them here to the enabled section. Now if you go back, you have auto unlock, you can pick for which apps you want to enable auto unlock if you have a passcode on your device. Lower here, you can choose how many apps you want to see per row, and you can choose also how many apps you want to see per row on landscape mode. Then you can enable labels, badges, and also rounded icons, and you can set here the size and also the transparency of the apps. You can also enable blur icon view background, which will blur the background of the icons on app box. Next up is Android Lock XT. This tweak will bring the Android style lock screen to your iOS 8 device. You can see here on my lock screen all I have to do to unlock my device is just draw the pattern that I have set in the settings of this tweak. Now let's go to the settings of this tweak, you can see here we have an enable button, then here you can set your pattern, and if you go back you have different themes you can choose from, here you have like 5 or 6 themes that you can choose, then you have appearance right here, you can choose circle, dots, selection, line, arrows, and pretty much you can customize the way the lock screen pattern looks. Now let's go back here, have behavior, here you can enable wrong pattern error, require immediately after 1 minute, you can enable vibration, you can set maximum attempts right here. And you can also enable bypass passcode and skip the slide to unlock text. The next tweak is called lock screen extender. As you can see right here, this tweak allows you to customize the slide to unlock text. You can also hide different elements of the lock screen and it allows you to move the clock anywhere you want on the lock screen. As you can see, all you have to do is just drag it and you can place it anywhere you like. Now let's go to the settings of this tweak, you can see here we have an enable button, then you can set the dim delay, you can hide the lock screen, clock and date, you can also hide the slide to unlock text, you can hide the lock arrow and you can set here a custom slide to unlock text, just go here and enter any text you like. Next up is a tweak called Atom. This is another tweak that allows you to quickly launch apps directly from the lock screen of your device. You can see you will get this button right here, all you have to do is just tap it and now you'll see here all the apps that you have on your lock screen. You can just drag this button to any of the apps that you want to open or you can drag it in the middle right here to unlock your device. Now let's go to settings right here, you can see we have an enable button, then you can enable default unlock gesture and also enable circular icons. Lower here have the icons that you have on your lock screen, to change one of the apps all you have to do is just tap it and select any app you like. Next up is lock editor. This tweak allows you to customize pretty much anything on your lock screen. You can see right here if I go to the lock screen of my device, and when I slide to unlock, you can see here this, the passcode buttons don't have rings around them, they look pretty cool. Now if we go to the settings of this tweak, you can see we have an enable button right here, then you have lock screen and passcode screen. If you go to lock screen, you can customize your status bar, time and date, the slide to unlock, also the grabbers, you can go here and hide any of the grabbers. Now if you go back, you have then the passcode screen, you can disable the blur, disable the button rings, no button animation, hide the emergency button, or you can set here custom passcode text for when you enter the passcode and touch ID requires passcode, you can enable it right here. And then just hit save, it will respring your device and all these changes will take effect. Next up is a tweak called Roman passcode. This is a pretty simple tweak, all it does is that it will replace the normal numbers on your passcode screen with Roman numbers. This tweak doesn't have any options to configure, all you have to do is install it. So that's it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, also go ahead and follow us on Twitter, you will find a link to our Twitter account in the description of this video.